Recently, Ripto sent ice wizards to Crystal Glacier to kidnap Shaman Tuck. The ice builders have been sending commandos to rescue him, but they haven't been very successful. In fact, the wizards have turned all of them into big blocks of ice. I think they need someone who can turn up the heat and help them out. Spiral, the ice wizards have imprisoned our leader, Shaman Tuck. Can you help us rescue him? It is urgent. He has our tickets to tonight's hockey game in Colossus Valley. If you get on the catapult, we'll help you across the chasm. this wall up ahead. I could arrange for you to cross this bridge for <clears throat> a small fee. Okay, I'll be here if you change your mind. Thank you, Spyro. Now I can buy that condo in Huracos that I've been wanting for so long. Go ahead across the bridge. Be careful on the other side of that bridge. I don't want anything bad to happen to my favorite customer.
Thanks, Spyro. Just hold tight for a second and look out below. <laughs> Those guys could have got me out of here without rolling a two-ton snowball onto my head. Here, take this crystal. I traded some hockey tickets for it. <laughs> with multiplying draclets. It's only a matter of time before they take over our whole village. Do you think you can get rid of them for us? Great! But remember, you have to catch them all quickly, because if any are left alive, they will continue to multiply. <laughs> us all from a grisly fate. Please, accept this orb as a small token of our thanks. I'll also make sure you get free snow cones whenever you visit us. my pet snow leopard. I was busy fishing and when I turned around, he was gone. I hope George didn't get eaten by the draclets. <laughs>
You found George. I'm so glad he's safe. I'll be sure to pay more attention to him from now on. All I have with me is this round shiny thing I caught while I was fishing. You can have it if you like. <laughs> Good job, Spyro! Rescuing Shaman Tuck wasn't easy. Now the Ice Builders can claim the Ice Wizard castles as their own. Though I don't know how long they'll keep it if they don't lay off the extreme sports. 